Next for Medicine High School, I call up Kristen Kim. Kristen Kim is a Korean American who is now a senior at Edison High School. She has lived in Edison all her life with her parents, brother, and her dog. As a varsity cheerleader, she also likes to cheer on the New York Giants with her family, as well as her brother who plays football for the freshman team at Edison High School. Although it is her senior year, she challenges herself with two AP courses and full schedule. After graduating high school, Kristen plans to attend college and major in early education to further her interest and in knowledge in young children. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., an honorable civil, civil rights movement leader, once <laughs> said, everyone can be great because anyone can serve. You don't have to have a college degree to serve. You don't even have to make your subject and your verb agree to serve. You only need a heart full of grace, a soul generated by love. Volunteering and service is never about oneself, but always about how, how one can give back to his or her community. At times, it may get frustrating to give up your precious free time to serve. However, it is always putting others before yourself that matters. <clears throat> Growing up in a Christian household, I was always motivated to volunteer. My parents have encouraged me to give up a few hours every week to help those who need it. As I got older, I started to be involved in sleepaway retreats and VBS events as a counselor. Not only did this give me experience, but it also taught me how to be humble. One event after the other, I found myself enjoying and making a difference just by giving up a couple hours of my time. I have been involved in the Care Charity Walk, Halloween at the High, Volleyball for Charity, helping out at the elementary school, and much more. One of the most memorable experiences I had was an event called Harvest of Hope. It is a program that my church has been involved in to make a difference in America's poverty and hunger. During the summer of 2010, my church, along with many others, went to Virginia to glean different fruits and vegetables and fields. We did not only glean food to give to the needy, but working in the fields under the scorching sun for hours taught us that we cannot take what we have for granted because not everyone is as fortunate as us, even in our own country. Volunteering and service has taught me not to be selfish, but to put the needs of others before my own. Seeing people smile about what I have done to help can be more heartwarming and rewarding than any other. I will continue to give up my time with a positive attitude to serve those who need it more than I do. Thank you. <laughs> 